So this TikToker, his name's Zachary, and he has a problem. His neighbors don't really like the way he drives. He often speeds through his neighborhood, revs his engine, and the neighbors hate it, specifically these neighbors, the Durhams. Mom, dad, and two sons, who we'll call 17 and 21, because those are their ages. And Zachary and the Durhams, they get into it all the time over this. Now eventually, Zachary, he starts filming these arguments and posting them to his TikTok. And everything changes when he films this. That's the Durham mom. Get my tag, Karen. My name is not Karen, so get my name straight. Now he posts this video to his TikTok and it blows up. Three million views. Now the Durham family, they see this video of them going viral and they get pissed off. And 21, he allegedly goes to confront Zachary. And I guess tries to pull him out of his own car and fight him. It's a whole mess. But it's great TikTok content for Zachary and he films the whole thing. So he starts posting about all this more consistently. And people on TikTok are loving the drama. It's getting him more views, it's getting him more followers. And things keep escalating and all this goes on for months. And one day, the youngest Durham son, 17, he's out riding his bike. And Zachary He's driving like an asshole, I guess. And he allegedly comes really close to hitting 17. So Durham mom finds out about this and she gets really mad and she goes to confront him. But this time she records the argument with her phone and there she is confronting him and they get into it. And I guess she gets a little too close to Zachary's truck and he kind of smacks her phone away and strikes her at the same time. Did you hit me? Did you hit me? Although it's kind of hard to see and I can't really show you anyway. So then Zachary hauls ass out of there and he drives back to his house. So the Durham dad and his two sons follow him back there and they are ready to whoop some ass. But Zachary, he ain't playing around. He comes out of his house, he has two friends with him. He also has a stun gun and a knife. And really quickly, this turns into a three on three brawl. Which I can't show you, but trust me, you're not missing much. Most of the footage looks like this anyway. Now at the end of the fight, Zachary kind of got beat up it seems, but he also got a few stabs in, one of them being really bad, puncturing Dad Durham's lung. So the fight ends and Zachary calls 911. And police show up and they make some arrests and they send Zachary to the hospital for concussion and the Durham family sends Dad Durham to the hospital for his stab wounds. And after all that chaos, Zachary's in police custody and he's still in his hospital gown when they give him this terrible news. Dad Durham didn't survive the fight. So Zachary gets charged with second degree manslaughter. And they have this long trial where his attorney argues it was self-defense. And after all that, at the end of it all. Not guilty. So he walked. And to this day, he still makes TikToks. And sometimes he talks about all of it. My life was ruined with this case. And sometimes he'll duet other people who talk about it. It's pretty crazy. Shout out to New Jersey.